Look how happy he's hopping around. He's been a super happy dog all day long today. Been out and about, doing work, catching up on so many things. And uh, just doing a horsey check. Need, it's a late day now. Um, I know it's been a little while since I've posted uh, some kind of update or what's going on, but it's not through lack of desire, it's just through lack of time and ability. Hi, Alina. How's it going, big girl? What? Is there something you need? <laughs> Hello, Mrs. Snuggles. Yeah, you need some scratches and stuff. I'll put you out in a bit here. Oh, I think I got a good spot. Uh, yeah, it's pretty close. Oh, it's up a little higher. It's over there. Not there, there. <laughs> it's not there. It's down there. Whoa. <laughs> I don't know, it's hard to tell. Look at that color of my hands now. Okay, moving on. Piggy. Piggy's looking good. Cleaning water buckets and getting them all full up. In a little bit here. Usually wait till they get a little bit lower. Just uh, waste a little less water and stuff. So here's Luke hanging out back here. It's <laughs> getting a lot of leaves in his paddock. These trees. It's a beautiful evening right now, by the way. Hi, buddy. Let's say hello to Luke. Hey, man. Whoa. Hello, Mr. Snuggles. Pretty, uh, pretty close you've come there. He says, can you just scratch my neck for me, please? Yeah. Most of his sweet itch is gone, but he just has a little left of his itchy itchies. Okay. Oh, here's some slash left over from a very, very, very busy week. So here it is. I thought I'd show you guys what, uh, what's what been going on. I've got a whole story to tell about it, but uh, the back now looks like this. Cleared off these big, huge trees. Cottonwood trees, they're so dangerous. And then just sort of leveled this out and Got rid of a couple other trees that were uh, hanging over. One of them was really coming, coming over and leaning way far. And uh, a couple of were rotten. So they're all gone. All the slash is piled way back there. And now I just got to finish sort of getting this a little bit better graded, but it comes over to here. And now I've got this, whoop, Jesus. This nice big open space that uh, I have big plans for. So phase four, part one is complete. Finally, it took the whole week to do it. Just an incredible amount of work. Trees come down, clean up the trees, clean up the shrubbery, get a little bit of gravel in, get that done, have the excavator obviously, clean that out, move it all around. Can't even explain. I mean, I will. I'll try. I didn't take a lot of video, but I did get some. I do want to talk about some some uh, some concepts, some things that can go on when you're trying to plan this try this type of stuff. So, uh, but right now, just checking on horses, and then dinner. Actually, the way the sun hits these trees. Fall is a beautiful time of year. This is a big maple comes in and lights it up. All right, Lena. Kick some horses out, I think. They were out a little bit this morning. I don't know where my dog went. Oh well. Oh, there he is, way over there. Hey, look, mushrooms. You know, I, so, I get so distracted. Random stuff like this grows in 
You know, it's not like you plant mushrooms, right? You go around, oh, I'll plant some mushrooms in the middle of my lawn. They just grow there. And in fact, they've been growing there for a while since um, you'll find, if you go out on some horse trail, if you're in part of the world where you've got horse trails around you, um, a lot of mushrooms, mushrooms will grow where horse manure was dropped and left. And, uh, and in fact, this area here, before it was grass, it was dirt and stuff. And um, I pre-fertilized or pre whatever with uh, horse manure, I just spread it all around. Because there's a lot of clay, so it's trying to turn it into better dirt, give it some nutrients. So that's what you get, you get mushrooms. And they grow every year, pretty normal. All right, so this thing, look at that. Just lit up, I love it. Poof, reds and yellows and oranges and a beautiful tree. Unfortunately, I have to take a little bit of that back because that branch there, it's leaning over quite a bit. I think it's a matter of time for it falls on somebody's car. Okay, so that's, that's the update for now. I will uh, be back very shortly uh, with more <sighs> pears everywhere. Uh, so see you guys then. Thanks for watching and um, I'll try to be back tomorrow. We've got lots going on this weekend. I'll do my best. Okay, let's find the dog, get some dinner.